Mike Sparks, I represent the 49th District, Smyrna Laverne, North Murfreesboro. Uh, proud to give you a little update um, of some of the things that's happening here in the state of Tennessee. Just last week, I was with Governor Haslam and Commissioner Dreshner and Commissioner Varney with uh, mental health and, and uh, substance abuse. Um, and also uh, uh, Judge Seth Norman with the drug court here in Davidson County. Really proud of, of their actions and, and, the, and the governor seems to really get these issues. You know, last year I brought up um, where my, my passion lies is, is what we're seeing in our culture with um, not only the prescription drug problem, but the meth problem and alcoholism and, um, and the fatherless rate and incarceration rate in some other areas. It just plays such a demand, not only on, um, on the fiscal, the budget locally and as well as the state of Tennessee, but also on families. And the governor himself mentioned last year, he said, Mike, he said, thank you for what you got to say. He said, our prison budget increased 46 million. The problem is unsustainable, and we've got to get to the root of this. Um, fortunately, we do have leaders such as Governor Haslam that seems to get this, and we do have leaders here in the state of Tennessee that seems to get this. And me as your state representative, not only have I had to deal with this in my family, but countless others have, have called me. Just, yes, just yesterday, a guy called me that's a local elected official battling a, a, a drug problem with his son. Another guy just 30 minutes ago on the way to the Capitol here, a local businessman in Laverne is battling some of the same issues with, with his son. I get countless calls here in Nashville, whether it's a, a grandchild or a son or a daughter um, that's battling some of these issues. But I want to assure you my office is always open. My number here at 741-6829. Feel free to call, and if there's any resources we have here to offer, my office is always open to try to assist. Thank you.